exhibit at the James S. McDonald Planetarium is drawing a lot of visitors. The reason? It's all about the total solar eclipse. Dana Dean came back to the office pretty amazed by it. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm just a little excited, can you tell? I mean, I, I learned so much. I've just been raving about it to everybody. You've got to go see this exhibit uh, before the solar eclipse happens, August 21st. I just, I just don't want to take these glasses off. A new exhibit at the planetarium lets you prepare for the total solar eclipse on August 21st. It's really cool to watch even the littlest of kids walk away from this exhibit and talk about things that they've learned. It's not just for kids. People of all ages are coming to this exhibit. This is a once in a lifetime opportunity here in the St. Louis area. The exhibit simulates what's going to happen during the total solar eclipse. An eclipse is a multi-sensory experience, so you're going to see it, you're going to hear it, and you're going to feel it. Animals will change their behaviors. You might hear birds switch from singing their daytime songs to their evening songs, and you may hear crickets come out actually during totality. You're also going to experience a temperature drop. The planetarium came up with a fun way for visitors to be able to experience what that's going to be like. When I stick my hand in here, you can actually see on the meter the lighting situation matching what's happening down here. And I can actually start to feel it's a little warm in the box right now, but now as we get towards and hit totality, it's actually starting to get cooler in the box. I'm hearing crickets going now, the birds have gone away, and now we're exiting totality. It's starting to warm up a little bit again. And of course this is sped up from what the eclipse is going to be, but it's really cool to kind of get an idea of what we're going to experience before it happens so we know what to look for. And when you're here, make sure to look for approved eclipse glasses in the gift shop. There's even a safe way to use these properly. Uh, what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to first look at my toes, then I'm going to put my glasses on. Now it's safe for me to look up at the sun. And then when I'm done, I'm gonna look back down at my toes. And that ensures that I'm not already looking at the sun when I go to put them on. That's the last thing we wanna have happen. Get prepared for a safe and fun experience by visiting the Planetarium's Total Solar Eclipse Exhibit. The free exhibit will be here until mid-September. The Science Center, by the way, is in the path of partiality. They'll see over 99% of the eclipse. So if you can't get to totality, but you can get to the Science Center, they'll be having a celebration at the Planetarium, live music, food, beverages. That is on August 21st from 10, 30 a.m. to 3 p.m. Let's talk about these glasses, which they sell in the gift shop at the Planetarium for $1.99. So I learned you, you gotta make sure they're approved. So you're gonna look on the back. There needs to be this eye, SO here got and there needs to be this C and E here. So if you got those two things, I'm told that you are you're good to go. Safe. You're okay. good to go. And you don't need the glasses in the exhibit. You you just love the glasses and want to wear them all the time. Right? But yeah. Oh yeah. I mean, if anybody can pull those off, it's you. You look good in them. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Except you didn't put them on properly that time. I mean, I know you don't have oh, no. to right now. Yeah. yeah. Okay. There, there you go. go. Thanks, Dana Dean. <laughs> There are so many viewers.